Good morning, Mrs. Good. Buer. Nice to see you again. Good morning. So to all our viewers, um, this is Mrs. Buer, who underwent a thoracoscopic atrial fibrillation ablation procedure, where we did a bilateral pulmonary vein isolation and a clipping of the left atrial appendage. That's when right. was that? That was three years ago. Three years ago? Yes. Already? Already. Seems like yesterday. Yes. <laughs> Good. So tell me, how long were you suffering of atrial fibrillation before you came to see me? About, so I'll say plus minus two years. Two years? Yes. Were you taking medication at that point? Only the blood pressure tablets that they gave me at that time. Okay. And you had an electroconversion beforehand in South Africa? Yes. Yes, okay. And so how did you find me? Um, my husband found you. He was How did he find me? On the internet. You mean that thing over there? The, yes. The internet. Yes, the <laughs> internet. Wonderful. Um, he found you there and when we heard that you're also English speaking, that was us. That we, helped. That helped. We knew okay. this is where we must be. <laughs> Très bien, because I also speak French. Uh -huh. And German and Italian. Oh. But that's a wow. different story. <laughs> so you ended up coming from South Africa to see me yes when you moved to Switzerland yes and then we did the procedure yes and what any memories about the operation yeah I do it was not all well because we did have a bit of complications but um, yeah. after all it went very well yeah we had in the some, long run yeah we had some problems. That's always when you do surgery, yes. there's always a risk of complications. And yes. at this point, um, these things happen. And we yes. had, uh, I think on the second day after surgery, we had some pleural effusion, yes. some blood accumulating in between the lung and the chest wall, yeah. which we, where we inserted the tube and got that out and got that problem solved. Yes. So where's your atrial fibrillation? No, I think it's totally gone now. So three years afterwards, it's gone. Yes. Are you taking any medication for that? No, I no. don't take any medication. But you need medication for your high blood pressure. Yes, I do. So we will get that sorted out by some specialists for blood pressure. Yes. Okay. Would you do it again? Yes, okay. I will definitely do it again. I can really advise anybody that that helped. It made a difference in my life. Yeah. And once again, you came to me thanks to your husband, yes. who went on the internet to find an yes. alternative to a catheter ablation. Yes. And that's how you found me. Yes. That is how 50% of my patients come to me, is over the internet. Oh, that's because it's, great. it's a new method and it's uh, starting to gain acceptance, but it's not that easy because you're fighting the establishment. Oh, okay. So hopefully, this video will help. Yes, fight, yes, absolutely. Well, I hope a lot of people view this and um, will definitely make use of you and your services. Okay, thanks a lot. Thank All you. the best and see you in the next three years. <laughs> yes, absolutely.